beautiful. Thank you for joining me. Let's move. We're going to start with the shoulders. We're going to bring it all the way up to the ears and all the way down. Again, bring it all the way up and then all the way down. I'm just going to move this down so you can see my feet. All the way up and then all the way down. All the way up and then all the way down. All the way up and all the way down. Shoulder roll, forward, up, back. Forward, up, back. Roll forward, up, back. Good, feels really good. So, forward now, I want you to go from the back and roll forward. Big, slow shoulder rolls, nice and slow. Take your time. So we're going to go into our decompression. So we're going to start feet, shoulder width apart. Weight on the heel, tailbone, going towards the back, hinge, weight. Bring the knees, also pass your toes. Okay, and now I want you to bring your fingertips together. And as you bring your fingertips together and going forward, try to go further back. Really stretch that spine, decompress, keep your neck aligned with your spine. Try to go as far back, push back. Now bring your arms a little bit higher, you should feel this in your lower back. Breathe into your chest, expand and then breathe out from the belly. Again, breathe into your chest, expand the chest. Hold the expansion and breathe out from the belly. Bring it down nice and slow. Now bring it, if you can't touch the floor, just bring it on your shins and push back. So I'm gonna go down the floor. Lean towards the back, weight on the heels. Always leaning towards the back, feel the stretch in the hamstring. All right, and slowly let's go back to 90 degrees, I'll be straight back. Fingertips together. Make sure your back is straight. Lean back as far as you can. Weight on the heels. Bring your arms a little bit higher. Now open up the arms. You should feel this. Now once you press in the knee, press in. You should feel this right into your inner thigh. You're probably going to feel some shake. That's normal. That's good. Thumbs down and let's bring it higher. Pull it here. Woo! Taking that back very strong. And bring it down. Good. We're going to go to our squats. So, if you have bad knees, just go halfway down and squeeze up. Those of you who have good knees, go all the way down and squeeze up. Down. Warm up those legs. Three more. One more. And hold it here. Good. I want you to bring your right leg back. Okay. I want your pelvis to be square. Big hips together. Breathe in. Breathe out. Relax your shoulders. But I want you to bring your sternum up, up. Pull up. Lean to your left, stretching your right side, open up your hip flexor. And bring it into the center. Alright, so we're going to go and do some lunges. So again, if this is all you can do, that's fine. I'm going to go all the way down, just go to the level that you're comfortable with. We're just warming up. Getting that blood flow to your muscles, your whole body. Getting ready for a good workout. One more. Okay, so now I want you to bring your hands to your side and I'm going to hinge. Hinge. So you're going to feel this more on your left side, on your left glute. So make sure that you're hinging, lubricate your hip joint. Back straight, we'll do one more. All right, so you're gonna reach forward. So this 
massage, reach as much as you can at the front. And I want you to bring your arms just a little bit higher. And just hold it here. You're going to feel a nice side of contraction on your left thigh. Give that glute. Hold it here. Really reach. Okay, now bring your right foot in. Shake up your left. And now bring your left side, left foot back. The same thing on that side. Take your hips together. You bend it up. Relax your shoulders, breathe out. Bring this up. Lean to your right, open up your left side. Hold that stretch. Bring it back to center. Keep your hips square. Let's do those lunges. And again, just go at the level that you're comfortable. Make sure your knee doesn't surpass your toes. Keep this 90 degrees. Last one. Hold. And let's do our hinge. Forward and back. So I'm only doing about, I don't know, 30 degrees in this range. Nice steady contraction here. So my weight is mostly on the right foot. And now hold it here. Bring your fingertips together. Reach forward, a little bit forward, a little bit more, hold. Bring your arms a little bit higher and hold. Breathe into your chest, breathe up in your belly. Good, and release, shake it out. All right, let's work that belly. The whole wall of your belly, I want you to breathe out, contract in, contract. Push those organs towards the spine, and then breathe in, expand. Breathe out, all that air from your belly, bring it all out, and contract, 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 nice and tight. Breathe in. Breathe out, bring all that air out. Hold. Breathe in. Expand the belly. Breathe out. Hold. Breathe in one more time. Breathe out. And breathe in. No special breathing. Let's just get connected with our belly. Let's start with the lower belly. Or just contract, pull towards the belly button. So and then I want you to push down and out. Contract, inward, really contract. Kind of do some pico, and then push out. Contract, in, 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 from the inside, towards the belly button, and then out. Contract those muscles, and push out. Contract, and push out. Now relax the lower, and just focus on the top. Contract. In, 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 and then push out. Contract, you can put your hands, you can feel the muscles working. It's a good way to connect. You can feel those muscles work. Let's do the bottom for two again. One, two, and the top, one, two. Bottom again, contract, push out, contract, push out. Top, one, two. All right, singles, you're gonna contract, push out, and then pop, contract, push out. One more time, contract, push out, contract, push out. Okay, we're gonna do some breathing again, so we're gonna do some belly rolls. So I want you to breathe, expand the whole belly. Now you're gonna breathe out, but start breathing out and bring in the air, contract the top, and bring all that air out, contract the bottom. Okay, now you're gonna breathe in by expanding here. Expand the bottom, and then breathe out, contracting the top. Contract the bottom. Breathe in. Expand. Breathe out. Bring all that air from the top here to go all the way to the bottom. Breathe in. 
Breathe out. Contract, contract, contract. Bring all that air out from the bottom. And breathe in, expand from here. Breathe in and then breathe out. Bring all that air out. Breathe in, expand from here. Breathe all that air down, all the way through the belly. The feather floor. And breathe out, contract, contract, contract. Bring all that air out. Breathe in. And breathe out one more time. Good. All right, so we're gonna start with doing some twists. Okay, go into a squat position. Bring your elbow here, we're gonna twist. One, two, twist, twist. This is nice and tight. Now let's go a bit faster. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now you're gonna bring it down to the right. Down. Keep the twist. So you twist and bring it down. 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now we're gonna go left. So we're gonna twist and then bring it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so now we're gonna increase our cardio, pull this up. And again, beginners. You don't need to bring a knee as high, you can just bring it halfway. But the level that you're comfortable. Now let's bring it front. One, two, three, four, five. Keep your back straight, just pull it from here. Pull. Now cross it over. Ow! Now let's do the left side. One, two, three. Alright. 
Focus on the drop, relax your jaw. And drop, 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 drop. One, two, three, four. Now you can stay in the center, or you can kind of tilt and drop diagonally. Tilt and drop, but if this is too advanced and too hard, just focus on the center. Just drop the center. Make sure your knees are in a squat position. I'm gonna go to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. Tilt, drop, tilt, drop. I'm still tilt and dropping. Good. Now if you're thirsty, go get some water. This is a good time. And now we're gonna work again right here in our quads. We're gonna bring about our feet just at an inner hip. Make sure you see feet. Okay, so soft knees, bent, tilt, drop, tilt, drop, tilt, drop, tilt, drop, tilt, drop. Now this time when you're Doing your tilt, I really want you to contract your lower belly. So the lower belly is pulling the pelvis upward. Contract, release, contract, release, contract, release, really contract. Contract, release. Let the contraction of that lower belly pull the pelvis upward. And then it's just release. So the release is just a nice little drop. Contract, release, contract, release. Keep going. Contract, release. Working that lower belly. Five, 
six, seven, eight, switch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now I'm gonna go and add some levels. I'm gonna go down. But beginners, please just stay at this level. Okay? You have to have really good knees, good balance. I'm gonna go down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then I'll switch. Go down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One more time. One, two, and again, you don't need to go down. This is more of a challenge and more advanced. Seven, eight, switch. One, two, three, four, five. Now four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Shake it out. Touch, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step. We're gonna try that with a touch step. Ow! Okay, so you're gonna go touch, step forward, touch, step forward, touch, step forward. Touch that forward, touch that back, touch that back, touch that back, touch that back. And then again, I'm gonna go sideways. One, two, three, four, and then back. One, two, three, four, forward. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. Front, two, three, four. Touch that, touch that, touch that. One and two and three and four and one. In place. Now bring arms. Down, down, down. It's right, it's left. It's right, it's left. Now bring it to the front. upper body. So we're going to bring our arms up. We will do something different but also going to work our obliques. So we're going to first, let's bring it up. Squeeze the shoulder blades in. Tight, tight, tight. And release. All the way up. Wrist goes up first. Nice and slow. And then squeeze the muscle on the shoulder blade. And up. And squeeze. Walk in the upper back. Woo! Get strong. Don't let to hold your arms. Feel the endurance. Now the rib cage. Let's go side to side. Side, side, side. So you're gonna contract and slide the rib cage. Contract the side and slide. If you have a hard time, you can bring your hands here to isolate so you don't move your hips. So we're going to go. One, two, three, four, and up, pull. Up, pull. Up, pull down. Up, pull down. Slide.
and your thighs, and let's go as fast as we can. Advance at the chest line. In the chest line, add the circle. Slide, circle, up to the left, and down, cross over. So this is very slow, but this is very fast.
create these beautiful figure eights. Lift and slide and lift and slide and lift and slide. All right. Beginners, just focus on your muscles here. Advanced, focus more on your arms and this snake arms. Chest one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
Hey, yeah, this is more advanced. Do, you don't need to go down. If you have bad knees, do not go down. Chest drop in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. Bye.